Welcome to the complete overview of the new Microsoft Flight Simulator 2024 update. Curious about how to update your simulator? Stay with me until the end of the video for all the details. Microsoft Flight Simulator 2024 has just received its ambitious patch 1.2.7.0, a major update featuring over 700 fixes, improvements, and new features designed to enhance the overall experience for both players and developers. While the simulator launched in November with significant upgrades, it also brought technical hurdles that this update addresses in detail. The big update released now addresses numerous long-standing issues, refines critical systems, and introduces new tools and functionalities to make the simulator more robust, immersive, and customizable. One of the most impactful features introduced in this update is the ability to manage third-party add-ons individually. Previously, players were often frustrated by the mandatory bulk loading of all installed marketplace content, which caused long startup times, reduced system performance, and compatibility problems. Patch 1.2.7.0 addresses this issue with a user-friendly interface that enables players to activate or deactivate individual add-ons based on their preferences. By default, Marketplace 2020 ported content is now disabled requiring players to manually enable desired add-ons to improve performance and shorten loading times. For PC users, this update significantly reduces resource usage, especially on systems that struggle with high-resolution mods or complex setups. It also prevents conflicts between outdated or incompatible add-ons. The revamped Marketplace interface enhances usability by allowing players to browse, organize, and activate only the content relevant to their gameplay. This streamlined approach not only improves the overall user experience, but also supports Microsoft's vision of creating a customizable and accessible platform for all users. In addition to these improvements, the update introduces safe mode, significant aircraft updates, refinements to career mode, and enhanced developer tools, marking a major advancement for the simulator. Safe mode, in particular, stands out as a critical usability improvement. This feature allows the simulator to start without loading custom add-ons, providing a clean startup environment. Players encountering crashes or performance issues can now use safe mode to isolate problematic files or modifications without resorting to manual troubleshooting. According to Microsoft, safe mode temporarily disables all add-ons, making it easier to identify and resolve issues while avoiding the need to manually remove content. This feature resolves one of the most time-consuming challenges for MSFS users, diagnosing crashes caused by conflicting third-party add-ons. By automatically deactivating all non-default content, Safe Mode restores the simulator to a functional state quickly and efficiently. Once the simulator is stable, players can reintroduce add-ons gradually to pinpoint the source of the problem, a process that significantly reduces time and effort. Safe Mode also reinforces the simulator's accessibility for less tech-savvy players who might otherwise struggle with community folder management or troubleshooting techniques. Its seamless integration ensures that users of all skill levels can enjoy a stable and reliable experience, even when encountering technical difficulties. With Patch 1.2.7.0, Microsoft has implemented a wide range of stability and performance improvements designed to enhance the overall gameplay experience. Among the key fixes are solutions to crashes caused by aircraft gauges, flight planning, and WebAssembly WASM, integration. WASM, a technology that allows developers to create complex, high-performance add-ons, had previously been a source of instability for many players. By addressing these issues, the update ensures that both developers and players can rely on WASM-based content without encountering frequent errors. Memory optimization is another critical focus of this update. Players using mid-range systems will notice smoother gameplay during resource-intensive scenarios, such as navigating congested airports or flying through detailed weather systems. For high-performance setups, the patch reduces micro-stuttering and improves frame rates, delivering a more consistent visual experience. These enhancements make the simulator more accessible to a broader range of hardware configurations, ensuring that players with varying system capabilities can enjoy a polished and immersive experience. 
Microsoft has also provided guidance for players to maximize performance after the update. Specifically, the developers recommend verifying the compatibility of community folder content and removing outdated or unused add-ons to prevent conflicts. This proactive approach underscores the company's commitment to maintaining a stable and optimized platform for all users. Aircraft have always been the heart of Microsoft Flight Simulator, and Patch 1.2.7.0 brings substantial updates across a wide range of models. From system-level enhancements to visual refinements, these changes aim to heighten the sense of realism and immersion for players at all experience levels. Additionally, Microsoft has addressed lingering issues related to animation clipping, texture alignment, and flight control responsiveness. These fixes extend to older modular aircraft as well, ensuring that the updates benefit the entire fleet available in the simulator. The improvements are a testament to the development team's commitment to delivering a polished and cohesive flight experience. Career mode has undergone significant refinements in response to player feedback, focusing on balancing gameplay and improving the overall progression system. One of the most impactful changes is the adjustment to breakware, which previously degraded too quickly and disrupted gameplay, particularly during repeated landings. With the update, breakware now aligns more closely with realistic usage, minimizing downtime between missions and enhancing the flow of the career experience. Weather conditions, particularly turbulence in extreme scenarios, have also been recalibrated. Players tackling challenging missions such as medevac and search and rescue will find that wind and turbulence now behave more predictably, reducing frustration while preserving the sense of challenge. This adjustment ensures that career mode remains engaging without feeling overly punishing, especially for players attempting to complete high-stakes missions. Several long-standing issues with scoring mechanics and mission objectives have been addressed in the patch. Navigation errors that previously affected mission completion and reward calculations have been corrected, ensuring that players are fairly compensated for their efforts. Bonus weather conditions and dialogue accuracy have also been improved, creating a more cohesive and immersive career experience. Perhaps one of the most exciting updates is the introduction of company renaming functionality. Players can now personalize their virtual aviation businesses, adding a sense of ownership and creativity to their career progression. This feature complements other customization options within career mode, further enriching the player's journey through the simulator. Iconic locations such as Mount Rushmore and the Great Barrier Reef now feature enhanced textures, better vegetation placement, and improved terrain detail. These updates provide a more lifelike representation of some of the world's most recognizable landmarks, adding to the simulator's immersive appeal. Shoreline rendering has been another focus area, with smoother transitions between land and water now implemented across the board. These updates address long-standing visual inconsistencies that detracted from coastal environments, particularly in areas with complex topography. Players flying low over beaches or navigating waterways will notice a significant improvement in the realism of these settings. Airports, critical hubs in the simulator's ecosystem, have also received attention. Enhanced level of detail scaling ensures that airports maintain visual quality at all altitudes, improving immersion during approaches and departures. Persistent issues such as floating objects and misplaced taxiway markers have been resolved, making airport environments more accurate and enjoyable for players. Additionally, the patch addresses terrain anomalies and environmental glitches that previously affected gameplay in specific regions. These fixes contribute to a more cohesive and polished world map, ensuring that players can explore the globe without encountering distracting visual errors. The update brings a host of improvements to Microsoft Flight Simulator's developer ecosystem, making it easier for third-party creators to build and refine custom content. The software development kit and dev mode tools have been significantly upgraded, addressing key pain points and introducing features that streamline the creation of add-ons, scenery, and custom aircraft systems. These changes reaffirm Microsoft and Asobo Studios' commitment to fostering a vibrant community of developers who continue to expand the simulator's capabilities. One of the most impactful improvements is the enhancement of WebAssembly, WASM functionality. WASM, 
a critical framework for creating high-performance, custom-coded add-ons, now operates more reliably, eliminating many of the crashes and compatibility issues developers previously faced. This refinement ensures that third-party developers can design and deploy complex add-ons without compromising stability or performance. As noted in the official release notes, enhanced SDK tools empower developers to push the boundaries of what's possible within the simulator. The SimConnect API, another vital tool for developers, has also been optimized in this update. These changes simplify the process of integrating external applications and systems with the simulator, enabling more seamless interaction between custom tools and MSFS's core functionality. Content creators working on advanced aircraft systems, mission designs, or virtual airline integrations will benefit significantly from these enhancements. In addition to functionality upgrades, new tools have been introduced for editing scenery and fine-tuning environmental assets. These tools allow developers to create more detailed and realistic locations, improving the quality of third-party scenery available in the marketplace. By making these resources more accessible and intuitive, Microsoft has lowered the barrier to entry for aspiring developers while providing seasoned creators with more powerful capabilities. The update also addresses long-standing bugs and inefficiencies in the SDK, providing a smoother workflow for developers. These fixes range from stability improvements in the development environment to better error reporting, ensuring that creators can identify and resolve issues quickly. The result is a more user-friendly and productive experience for the growing number of developers contributing to the MSFS ecosystem. Installing patch 1.2.7.0 is a straightforward process, but Microsoft has provided additional guidance to help players ensure a seamless update experience. The patch is available directly through the Microsoft Flight Simulator client, where players can check for updates and download the latest version. To prevent potential conflicts, players are advised to verify the compatibility of their third-party add-ons, particularly those stored in the community folder. Safe mode can also be used to test the update in a clean environment before re-enabling add-ons.